subscribe and press the bell icon so you never miss an update from prep ladder so what are the markers of these cells the markers of these cells are typically two markers other one is called cd16 and second one is called cd56 these are the two markers there are way to remember these markers for natural killer cells you have a traditional mnemonic for this we call them as sexy 16 or natural killers you can remember so you can write sexy 16 or natural killer cells so what are the objective evidence of structural and functional cardiac abnormality for example there could be increased lv mass index of more than 95 grams per meter square in uh, females or more than 115 grams per meter square in males or there could be increased relative wall thickness of more than 0.42 at least or increased la volume index of more than 34 ml per meter square this is something we discussed already if the brain stem is not intact that means even at this pseo2 level the respiratory movements are not going to be triggered right so when there is breach in the capillary barrier and alveolar barrier like you're seeing in this image the fluid leaks into the alveolar space so the type 1 pneumocytes are basically the ones which cause or which are responsible for forming the alveolar lining right and type 2 pneumocytes are the ones which secrete surfactant so there is a breach in this alveolar lining there is a breach in the capillary lining because of the endothelial injury so the fluid leaks into the alveolar space and accumulates it and this fluid is exudative right this is not a transudative this is not a hydrostatic pressure that is driving the fluid into alveolar space this is exudative fluid